am headed to get Braylon some. Um, he like is having a hard time eating the hospital food. He thinks the hospital food is trash, but you know how it is. He's like, the pizza has no grease on it and there's no sauce. And so yeah, I'm going down to get him some Uber. I got him a Slurpee. Hopefully he can get all the way down, but it looks like we have some stops on the way. We're all the way up on the top floor, so. Like I just got into a freaking five minute argument with the Uber driver because he said that I told him I think it's just a language barrier. Anyway, he's pulling up here now. And I don't know. I'm just, just trying to figure out how to tell him where to go. I think this is him. Yeah. Here we go. He looks nice, but we were definitely both confused. Thank you so much. I'm so sorry. Over there, you were over there. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I don't. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. Um, we've been here like seven days, so I'm so ready to go. So next time when you put it, put it in the children. Children and, hospital. Yeah. See, some right children hospital, and the other oh. is the children, but the emergency. Not the emergency. Okay. No. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you. That's why I'm being the emergency. Yes. All right. I thought about that. No, yeah. don't worry at all. It's not your fault. Thank you. Okay, so at least that beef is squashed. Now, hopefully, they don't make me go through all this damn emergency. I've already done this 18 times. Uh, no, I've been here for like seven days, but. Oh, you're picking up food? Well, I'm taking it. I just got it from the Uber driver. Oh, okay. All right, so you already got your passport today? Yeah, I think okay. so. I've just been staying here overnight for like seven days. Okay. Thank you. Oh, thank God, I have too much shit in my hands, guys. This is so sad. And oh, thank God I caught the elevator because it takes forever. Slurpee on my neck. <sighs> Why I'm trying to film this, I don't know. You guys are probably like, this girl thinks she's superwoman. I'm just so glad I caught the elevator. That couldn't have been much better time. Sometimes it takes like 15 minutes to catch it. Braylon's gonna be so happy I got him a Slurpee that your kid is starting to feel better when he wants gas yeah, station food instead of hospital food. Okay, now I got a better grip on everything. But um, pretty much today, Braylon got up and walked. He did go high in the blood uh, pulse again. He was up at like 160 again, but they still walked him a few times. But now he's sitting down playing the video game and he's on the heart monitor and his heart rhythm is going a little wonky. It's like um, going real low and then real high and then real low and then real high. So he's stable, but they want to do another EKG because that's the, re reason, <laughs> that's the reason why we skipped the pacemaker is because we felt like his rhythm was intact. But now right before he's about to go home, we're getting some irregular arrhythmias. So that's a little update. So Braylon got the blue Slurpee. That's his favorite color. I got the Coke one. It's looking a little frostbitten, so I'm hoping that it is good. And then I got us uh, some taquitos. Braylon said he didn't want one, but I got two because, you know, everybody always says they don't want something until it's in their face and then they want it. Then I got us uh, some. Got Braylon some M&M's. I got me some M&M's. Popcorn. Onions, gummies. These are some of our usual snacks that we eat around the house. Salt and vinegar chips, pistachios. This is some of Braylon's favorite beef jerky. So, got you some beef jerky too, baby. So, yeah. yeah, so I think it's really good that he's playing the game and that they're watching his heart rate and stuff because this is kind of what he was doing before. Um, he went into cardiac arrest that he can remember. So I think it's good he's playing so they can kind of monitor his heart rhythm while he's on this, um, even though it's kind of going weird. So definitely want you to keep playing the game, Braylon, so when they come in here to do the thing, they can see how your heart reacts. Okay, so they're thinking that it might be because the lead was on incorrectly. Like, it, you know, after you have these leads on for a while, they start to fall off and stuff. So she replaced the leads and now his heart's not doing that funky little arrhythmia anymore but also his magnesium was a little bit low so they gave him some um they're giving him some mag to go through his iv um and then he's gonna eat he needs to um use the bathroom before they want to let him go just to make sure everything is like flowing correctly 
and we're waiting on dad so that's kind of where we're at braylon absolutely hates milk and magnesia he just anything chalky or like milky he cannot so he almost like gagged and i freaked out so i like dumped this bucket and gave him a bucket so he could peek in if he needs to but hopefully no more gag reflex huh yeah you feeling okay okay good so yeah we're just waiting on dad to get here and then hopefully he doesn't have any more arrhythmias so that we can leave to drop off some of um, Braylon's scripts and they do not have them available so a lot of them are over the counter I'm gonna just see if I can find them here because I don't want him to miss a dose um, multivitamin you see I need a magnesium buy one get one free so you can't go wrong with those the colace is gonna be somewhere over here Mm, this is perfect. This is the generic docusate sodium. It's the same thing as colase, so we're just gonna go with that. And then the antacids because he had a lot of blood in his stomach, so I need pepsid, which is also famotidine. So I'm thinking acid reducer. What is this? Famotidine. Famotidine 20 milligrams. Okay, so yeah, they had everything in here. Perfect. This should at least hold him over until the morning. They said nothing will be ready until midday tomorrow. I'm gonna get him some lip stuff too because his lips are dry. Look at me. My lips are dry too. Oh, you took the wires home. <laughs> Good job, sweet boy. Watch that leg. Stuff is dead. Good job. Marco and I just prayed a hedge of protection over our baby. Yeah. Wow, we just got yeah. out of this car because this is the place where everything happened and we were just praising God for, for a place of tragedy that Lord made into a place of victory and how we can just continuously praise him and give him all the glory and all the honor for our baby boy. Use the enemy as your footstool, Braylon. This is exactly where your body laid when we performed all of the life-saving measures on you. And look, you walk right back into your house without a worry in the world because God got you on the seventh day. And God says that seven is a number of completion, right? You are healed in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. You feel really good. Do you? You probably feel good to be back in your house. something he has a new little buddy in him right now oh where's that um that's nothing he can throw that one off but he has a new little buddy in his uh in his chest over here and i don't want you to touch it okay okay because he, he got to heal up first okay <laughs> can you play the game with me he can't can't yeah he can't play the game with me he can he can yeah. okay let's go play <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen you go mom. I know, I haven't seen you either. I love you. I freaking miss you, buddy. 
You're so stinkum cute. Oh, you. I miss you a long time ago. I miss you such a long time ago, honey. You're such a good I, boy. I miss Byron a long time ago. No, yeah, true. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy to be I know. Thank you, Jesus. Kaden, Bubby's here. That means Brian is never going to go to the hospital? Never again. <laughs> he doesn't need to ever wait, again. Wait, let's get the family a hug. Okay. Hey, Grandma. Let's come. This is real life. Okay. We're so blessed. Look at my baby. Oh my goodness. He's so happy. B. Baby. What do you think Kaden. about Braylon, Kaden? He's so happy. You can tell how happy he is. I love Braylon. He's amazing. Dude. Fire. 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 <laughs> <laughs> what would you do without me? I don't know, babe, but I need you right now. These braids hurt. I can't do no braids, ever. Marco just made his mom do this so he could come looking presentable to the hospital. And he's, like, begging me to take it out, so. Um, Braylon's over here drinking lots of electrolytes with his... What is that called, baby? Pedialyte? He took his medicine for tonight, so he doesn't have to take any more medicine until tomorrow. Um, we're all just chilling in here. Kaden has, like, turned into a whole new baby. What did you guys do with my baby, huh? Look at him. He's a little strong little tank now. All right, Look, move. he likes... What are move. you giving him? This is water. Pellegrino. Sparkling water? Hi! Mark Cannon, what do you want to say? Do you want to watch the Wednesday movie? <laughs> Why don't you tell everyone who is your girlfriend going to be when you get older? It's going to be Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're just hanging out with the family. Yeah. Feels good. And it's so dark, babe. I'm doing this while it's dark. So we'll talk to you guys in the morning. Um, it's just a good day where he's. baby. Oh my God. Your baby. <laughs> It's about time. We all need like a reset. So tomorrow's gonna be all about a reset. Yes, completely reset. Everybody gotta get in order. Everybody, Everybody get... gotta get in the tub. Yes, <laughs> showers, everything, hair done. Oh my God, haircuts, hair done, everything. Yes. Sorry, we're watching Wednesday. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.